Fate's an ugly fish, Ray sometimes says, among other strange metaphors, that grow more colorful as the day wears on. I ladle slush from the fishing hole, cradle my thermos of spiked coffee, and nod along to his stories. Piercing blue skies and new snow on the frozen lake. Ray measured 12 inches of ice and called it 15 so he could drive his truck out here. In three hours, we caught five decent-sized perch. A perfect day until Ray gets snagged. He wrestles with his line, cursing that it's his favorite lure down there. Now he's reeling in something heavier than a fish, with no fight in it, only the bulk of the object dragging against the frigid black water. Ray kneels, yanking at what's wedged against the underside of the ice hole. It's a lamp, he says, bemused. It's, it's Val's. I look over his shoulder and see her familiar brass porch lamp. We both go silent. Val hosted the best happy hours on her porch. Her cabin, along with ten others from the ridge, was washed into the lake a few years back by heavy spring rains. A freak event. Some of those cabins had been around for a hundred years. Yep, fate's an ugly fish.